pretty much today I'm on my way to uh, an island called Cape Cocker and I have to take a ferry so the way I got here is from Pemelpan I took a bus to Belize City and then from Belize City I took a cab to the water taxi and I'm just waiting for the water taxis to open up so we can go over there I'll be there for like one night just want to check it out this is the, the ferry port This island is really, really small. I don't know if you guys can see it on that side. There's the ocean. And then, like, four blocks. There's the ocean. It's really tiny. So, I've run into a problem since I got here, and that's that. Um, I brought pesos, Mexican pesos with me, and I was like, I'm gonna just exchange them here in Belize, but you can only exchange them in the border, and I wasn't there. I didn't exchange them while I was there. So the thing that happened now is that I don't have any money. I have money, but I can't use it. Nobody wants to exchange it. So I either have to go back to the border and exchange it, or wait till I go to uh, Guatemala. That's in three days, and I'm really low on money now. So I'm trying to find a bank so I can get some money out of the ATM, which is going to charge me a fee, and then my bank's going to charge me a fee. So that's where we are right now. But if I get money, I might go uh, snorkeling, which is really expensive here. So this right here is the other side of the island. I'm sure there's a totally legit explanation. But, uh, why is there always a crappy side and a nice side. Like this will be the crappy side. I've seen that a lot in my house. Like one side is nice and beach and like sand and everything. And the other side is like, like this. It's just like crap. I'm sure there's an explanation. So this beach, well this island went through a hurricane, well a hurricane went through the island, I don't know when, like a few years back, so it split the island into two, and this is where the split is. And I'm hanging out with two German girls. And let me see if I got this right. Anna and Micah. Micah? Yeah. <laughs> and they're from Germany and we're just gonna go chill for a while. They're in the same hostel I'm at. So. Let's check this out. It's not really a beach, it's just a duck. <laughs> So that's the other side over there, where the sword split. So I came back to see the sunset. Do you ever do any time lapses with that? Yeah, yeah. but uh, I need like a tripod and everything, and I didn't bring my tripod. Oh. Well, that's Spanish. Yeah. So, I find that many people here, they act totally different than Asians. Like the culture. It's still pretty dark, but you might... How they program it to do it. It works really well. Because amazing time lapse. There it goes. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone.
Okay. So, so we just had a few on years on the door. Bunch of yeah, international a pad. people yeah. from Berlin. <laughs> yeah, on the first street. New York. Yeah. At Marcos. On the left. So you go down here. Germany. Down the first street. <laughs> yeah. And before <laughs> Amor Cafe. California. Okay. Before. On the left hand, side, left hand side on the door, you sign um, in your name. Canada. 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 <laughs> yep. <laughs> And so we're you guys. We just had a few <laughs> beers here at. What, yeah. What's the name of the place? Huh? What's I the name of the place? I am Reggie Bar. Reggie Bar. Reggie Bar, yeah. <laughs> I am. Uh.